Hello guys, this is Simple Cody. In this video, I'll be teaching you guys how to add more builds to your wizard. Now, if you don't have a build or a wizard, make sure to check out my video, uh, which I'll leave an annotation on the screen. It was on how to create your own build slash wizard. So, uh, let's say you want to add uh, a build, uh, more uh, more than one build to your wizard. So, let me explain what that means. So, if you go to your wizard on Cody, as you can see, I have one build. Let's say I want to add more. It is possible, and it's really simple to do. So just uh, follow this tutorial, and you'll be good. So let me exit out of Cody. Now, in the last video, we were using this file right here, which was the wizard folder that I made you guys download if you followed the tutorial. Go ahead and open it up. And we had the wizard.html uh, file, which which was the .txt, but we changed it to an HTML because we were hosting on... 00 web host. So if you go ahead and edit, uh, open it with the normal Notepad or Notepad++, I suggest using Notepad++. As you can see right here, we only have uh, we have the one build. So adding a second build is really simple to do. You just make sure to copy the same code right here from P to this P basically, and just paste it right here under. Now you could go ahead and change the name. So I'll call it build2. You could go change the link so it's another build. It's not the same build. But for this video, I'll just keep the same build so uh, it's faster. You could change, of course, the icon and the fan art and description. I'm going to change the description to something else. Uh, my second build. So that's pretty much it for adding a second build to your wizard. So if we click on it like that, as you can see, there's no space between uh, between the both builds. To put a space so you guys could uh, easily understand the code when you have uh, when you're editing it or something, just make sure to add this code right here. It's basically greater than br less greater than the signs, and just closing it out, and hit save. And when I open it up, you see there's a space right here. So now after just editing the files and the links, uh, adding the uh, editing the name and the links and the images, if you guys need to, uh, go to zero zero web host. Then uh, sign in. You should have an account if you followed the other tutorial. Scroll down, file manager. Sign in your account. You should know how to do that. Go to public underscore HTML wizard and delete the old wizard.html and we're going to upload the new one we just edited so wizard.html hit the check mark and go back make sure you uh, delete the old one and put the new one and uh, make sure it has the same name and exactly in the same spot because if you don't if you don't put it in the same spot you're going to have to change the the add on uh, the default.py right here the code at uh, the link so make sure it's in the same place and the same name don't put any capital letters. So now if we open up Cody, we go to my wizard. So programs, simple Cody wizard. As you can see, I have the second build right here. Uh, they're both the same, as I said, and they both work. And they're both the same uh, build, basically, because I didn't change the link of it. If you want to make it a different one, of course, you need to change the link. So Right there, they both work. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys found this video helpful, please uh, drop a like and subscribe. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comment section below, and I'll try my best to help you. So thank you very much for watching this video, and uh, and have a nice day. Bye bye.